Hello and welcome to my weekly channel update. Uh, I am on my um, Frostland server, uh, which I haven't really been on much. Um, I was going to go on Kira server, but I haven't been able to get on that server for like days now, m almost a week. I don't know why, if it's down or if it's just me. I know my friend Droid Raven can't get on the server either. I haven't seen any posts or anything about it, so I don't know what's going on. But uh, so I thought I'd make my channel update on my old server, Frostland. So let's go back into first person view and let's put in this. Um, I I have no new builds to show off because I haven't well because I haven't built anything. That <laughs> kind of <laughs> logic. Uh, but yeah, but there's a lot of things to talk about in this video. I have a lot of stuff, so I don't know. This video might get a bit longer than most of my channel updates. I hope that is okay. I'm gonna walk around and you can see some of the stuff I built here. Uh, if you haven't already. My chicken coop. But anyway, first off, let's uh, just mention some of the stuff I am going to be talking about. One, I have finished X-Men Legends 2. That's right, I have finished X-Men Legends 2 and this looks really awesome from here. Look at this. This is actually a very beautiful area. And all the trees there I planted. This is not a natural area. This is created. This looks pretty cool. Anyway, yeah, I finished X Men Legends 2. That will be. Uh, we'll review that. That'll take a while, probably. I got a lot of things to talk about, both good and bad. And of course, I am going to introduce my new game, which I have already started playing. I'll get to that later. I'll be talking a little bit about uh, how the channel. The ch status status uh, situation of the channel right now, and and I will be talking about a possible new server, uh, but we'll get back to that later. Let's start off by talking about X Men Legends 2. Awesome game, a uh, really awesome game. A lot longer than I thought. I think a creeper blew up here. A lot longer than I initial uh, had thought, but uh, that's okay. I really let's talk about the good stuff. The good stuff. Well, overall, it was a great game, and that I could talk up for hours about why that was a good game. But it's easier. I always think it easier to uh, talk about some of the few good highlights, and it's it's more better to go into detail with some of the bad stuff because I'll say that uh, overall. I enjoyed the game. It was a great game, and I will highly recommend it for people. Um, some of the stuff I really enjoyed, of course, is me being a huge uh, Marvel fan, a huge X-Men fan, especially. And it, it, it was nice seeing all my favorite characters come alive, and me controlling my favorite characters and stuff like that. That was really cool. I enjoyed a lot of the different uh, powers you had. Even though I <laughs> t uh, used most of the same ones, but I enjoyed it still. I enjoyed that they taken both as, as uh, well, especially as the villains. They've taken a lot of the more unknown characters and brought them into the game. And I have to sneeze just a moment. <coughs> Sorry about that. But yeah, that was really fun. Um, the graphics was really great. I liked that they. I think they they maintained kind of a. A comic book look to the to the game, which was really cool. And the different locations, which were plentiful, uh, really nice, and a lot of locations were like from the comic books and stuff like that. It was really a nice game with some nice features. Let's talk about the bad stuff. Like I said, the good overweighed the bad, which means that I enjoyed the game very much, but there was a lot of Flaws, glitches, stuff like that. Uh, let's talk about. Let's just. I don't know. I'm not mentioning this in any particular order. I'm just mentioning it as it comes to mind. Uh, one of the things was that uh, the overall AI of my companions was horrible. A lot of the times they just stood in the in corners. They they didn't use their powers very tactical, I don't think. 
they kept and that was not probably not an AI but a probably just a program programmable programmed feature that they always followed me instead of finishing the fight they were starting that was quite annoying because that means if I were to let them fight off a battle and go over and for instance go to this bar and check something out and they were fighting over by uh, well somewhere else they would come to me instead of finishing the fight I was really just annoying then there was the whole turn around thing you know where I was I would do like a lightning strike here and the next lightning strike when I do that will automatically turn around which I saw no absolutely no purpose in why that was a thing mm, what else were there oh better go to sleep but then there was the we had the the, the targeting system even if there was a target let's say right there the lightning would strike there which was ridiculous because you yeah you could I think you could yeah you, you could with the mouse target the enemies but when there were enemies all around that was really that became almost impossible to do um, a lot of the bosses seemed to you, you didn't really know what to do the first time so th it was really hard not to die the first time around I was about to break that glass but I wouldn't do that um, uh, what else? Um, th it became a little repetitive at times. A lot of the bosses, uh, uh, not, no, not bosses, enemies, even though seemed differently, they felt the same. A, a lot of the, I think we had a lot of the, it seemed more like an, uh, I don't know, a, a non X Men game at times. Some of the enemies seemed to have just, I don't know what I'm talking about. Then there was the whole uh, shield thing that where you have to use a certain combination of hits to remove that shield from them. That most of the time that just didn't work. Uh which and other times I I felt that it was a stupid feature because here we had an enemy that uh, I could hit with lightning, claws, fire and stuff. It wouldn't help, but if we did a certain combination of hits like an uppercut or a something. Oh, then it worked. So, for realism, for immersion into the game, that was seemed a little dumb that that was a thing. And but mostly, what mostly annoyed me was, of course, that it didn't work at all at times. Um, what else do we got? Uh, we got. Uh, I can't actually think of anything more bad about the game. There were some other things I complained about during the game, but uh, there was, most of that was small things. But if I m if I remember uh, some of it, I will come back to it again. Uh, this is a tunnel. This took me a long while to make. This was actually made by hand, and I didn't know where I would or when I would come out on the other side, which was probably just. A little dumb. I should probably have planned over here. Let's go down here. Oh yeah, this is my subway down here. Uh, this is actually very bright. Jesus, when did it become this bright? This is weird. Is it, have they changed the lighting? Anyway, let's eat. <laughs> But anyway, uh, what I was trying to say, this uh, subway is actually, if you go back, you can see, uh, you can search subway in my videos. This is the video that got the most views, which is kind of strange. I guess that means that, uh, it's the, well, I guess it's the thing with YouTube where if a video gets a lot of views, it keeps on getting a lot of views. If everybody sees it. So this is, I don't know, it's gotten over a thousand views. And it's still, even though it's an old video, people still comment on it, and I, I, I enjoy that. I wish that, but I wish that people wouldn't check out some of my... There's something missing right here. Check out some of my newer videos as well. Uh, let's take this minecart. Do I have a minecart? Nope, I don't. Let's just take this. Okay. But anyway... Uh, yeah, so I'll be starting a new game later tonight, but I will still keep that a little su suspense still wait okay anyway and uh, why am I sitting so low 
What's going on? Am I... You, usually not that low. That's kind of weird. This is then done by hand in survival mode as well. This tunnel. This was a pain in the ass. The, the lake over me. Which I had to alter while going under, which was probably dumb. I can't get... I can't get out of this. What the hell? No, no, no! I can't leave the... What the fuck? Okay, this is a weird glitch. I can't leave the minecart. Okay, now I can, probably can. I wanna get out! Okay, while we're going back and forth in this minecart for the rest of the video... Uh, <laughs> I really hope we're not. But, um... Yeah, okay. Talking about something else. Uh, the status of my channel. Um, I think I mentioned this in a video, but... Um, yeah, I've been getting more. I have now 113 subscribers. I was up at 114, but you always swing a little. I'm glad that I haven't gone below zero again. Um, but the weird thing is, and that's... This... That I've been getting more subscribers, but less views. I think this might have something to do with it being summer holidays and stuff like that. I really want to get out of this minecart. Let's look at how this... What the fuck is going on? Can I just... Well, this is, um... Annoying. Oh, you have to shift-click it now, the minecarts. Oh, that's because they changed it because of the horse update. They haven't been in a minecart in the new update. I just recently uh, actually updated my Minecraft. I apologize about that. Uh, <laughs> that feels stupid now. But yeah, uh, a lot of if, if a lot of uh, new subscribers, but less views. So I hope that uh, picks up again, especially with my new series. I I have a feeling that might take up some new viewers. But, uh, and if you, uh, I know some people download videos, if you do, and because, uh, if they download them because that of uh, their connection being poor, or YouTube has some really weird glitches where it stops in the middle of a video, and it's understandable why people want to download them. But remember to at least start off the video, because even if you only, like, run a, like, a fl I'll, I'll, I would like to see the views. Yeah, I hope people get what I mean. And of course, press like if you like it. Uh, I've been getting some dislikes. I really hate the dislike button. I see no purpose of it. If people... I mean, people, if they dislike, they should at least explain why. If it's just that they find this boring, well... Jesus Christ, I should press dislike on a lot of videos then. But if you don't, if you find my videos boring, then don't, don't watch them. It's that easy. My swimming pool, I really love this place. Um, my modern house. Really, been a while since I've been here. And oh yeah, I remember. Uh, I finished the carpet, didn't I? Yes, I did. I had this was gone for a while because I needed some roofing for that building down there. But yeah, I have a new lot of new subscribers, and I hope that people will maybe start. Maybe people have been busy with exams and stuff like that. That could be it. I've never thought about that before now. So I hope people will uh, be, uh, my views will be picking up again. Uh, X-Men Legends 2 wasn't as a successful series, but as I say in one of my videos, and I think in one of, it's one, uh, I think it was my last X-Men video, uh, which was out yesterday, I talked about that some, it might still get views even though it's finished. I myself go back and watch people's older series too, if it's something I'd like. And I hope people will do that as well, on from on my channel. But uh, yeah, um, let's talk about new server. That's right. I am thinking about starting a new server. I I, I talked about in the last update that I might stop to play on Kira's server. Uh, I'm not saying that I completely stop, but I'm o well now I can't get on for some strange reason. But I might just not play as much because it's it's just annoying that people still grieve. And even if I get my uh, protection to work, they can still, like they've done, So sometimes they can kill my animals. They can 
my rails, I cannot protect those because they are in an area that's not mine. And it's just annoying. But and I thought about uh, if if I start uh, if I make a new server, I I I could just go back to this one. But I really want to start a new one actually because mo well because there's been changes to Minecraft since this is an old even temples and pyramids wasn't even in the, the uh, in the game when I started this. So they will be hard to find. Uh, the Nether is totally messed up. Uh, there's no quartz in this because. Of course, uh, there wasn't no quartz in, and I haven't been able to find another fortress in the Nether either. If you've seen some of my older videos, you know that I've been once were stuck in the Nether for two hours. That's a long time, uh, and I didn't find. And as I walked around trying to find my way out, I couldn't find any um, Nether fortress. So that's and like I said, quartz isn't in it, and there's been a lot some other changes too. So, and sometimes it's just fun to start a, a new world. So I might do that, but as a, but it'll be at first it'll just be me and a couple of my real life friends, and it'll be one of those servers you can download for free, you know, and just host uh, on a local host. I have to talk to my internet providers, getting my. Uh, router uh, set up to be able to do such a thing because it, it costs a little extra but nothing much but if um, but later I might actually make a server that is online uh, with a host stuff like that which will still be a private server but I'll start uh, inviting people uh, maybe some other youtubers maybe some of my subscribers Maybe some of the people I met on uh, Kira, so I, uh, Kira will of course be invited because I mean, even though I'm quitting her server, I don't have any. It's not like I'm, I'm mad at anybody or mad at her. I think she's a wonderful person and um, she makes wonderful videos, and I do enjoy her server. But I'm more, I think I'll enjoy more having my own and also b a whitelisted server, a completely whitelisted server where you have to qualify to be whitelisted. So yeah, so she will of course be whitelisted if she wants to. Uh, she she doesn't, I mean, she'll probably be busy with a lot of her own stuff, but she'll be more than welcome to come on my server because she is the inspiration that uh, for making a server. And But it'll still be a whitelisted server, but I have to check out my economy. I have to buy a new computer soon. I know I've been talking about this for a while and I've been I talk extremely fast right now. <laughs> I just realized that. But yeah, I will be uh, buying a new computer and we're really close to getting it bought. I mean, within the next 14 days, the next two weeks, I will have a new computer unless something goes terribly wrong, which I probably it probably doesn't. If everything goes as planned, I'm actually going with a buddy of mine out to look at a new computer and possibly order a new computer tomorrow. Um, so yeah. Um, what else is there to talk about? This has been a long update where I've just been wandering around. Uh, if you have any questions to some of the things I have passed along the way that I've shown, feel free to ask uh, if uh, any of the buildings interest you. Um, I will still be be on this server for a while, uh, w once in a while, but it won't be my main server, the one I'm playing on. But fir at first, like I said, it will just be me and a couple of buddies. This is my basketball game. This was just a short idea. I could work out something better. Um, then, yeah, recently, I know there's been, uh, like, Monday and Tuesday. No, Tuesday and Wednesday. There was, I only posted three videos instead of four. And, well, actually, Tuesday I was supposed to post five. And that was because I really... Uh, lack of sleep, extreme lack of sleep. Uh, some road construction, road work had been going on. And it's starting really early. And it's really been annoying. It's pretty much over now. So I have been getting into a better sleeping pattern. Which is totally awesome. Uh, so the videos will be up, and I've actually started to get ahead on videos, which I, I I've I've been getting ahead on videos before, but I think this time it will actually be a lot uh, better, smooth. I will be able to maintain uh, my being ahead a little better. That was a weird sentence. Um, 
And now, the moment you all have been waiting for. I'll be introducing my new game. And that game is Far Cry 2. Yes, while everybody else seemed recently have been playing Far Cry 3, I choose to play Far Cry 2. Why? Well, be mostly because I own it. Uh, <laughs> but also because it is an amazing game. It's one of my favorite first-person shooters of all time. I have played this before, I never completed it. I don't know how far I've gotten in it uh, when I previously played it, because I really don't know how long it is. But it's been a while, so I haven't... It's not like I remember a lot of the things I already played, so it will be... It'll seem like I'm doing a blind playthrough. Well, most. At some point, anyway. I have already started playing it, uh, started recording it three videos so far, and uh, in my opinion, they have become quite successful. Uh, the first one will, of course, be out later today. So yeah, this is, I uh, hope uh, people will enjoy it. Far Cry 2 is an amazing game. It's one of the best, some of the best driving in a first-person shooter I've ever seen. So, but, uh, and I, it's, it's a long game. Um, but one of the things that uh, kind of I felt that about the X Men Legends 2 videos was that it became quite boring because I died a lot. It became a lot of the same, and I got pissed because of all the flaws. And Far Cry 2 doesn't really give the same feeling. I because this is a game I know. I didn't really know much of X Men Legends. I didn't expect it to be that long, for instance. But I do with this game. I really so. I do uh, know that it's going to be long, so I think that I will enjoy playing this more, even though I, I really, X-Men Legends 2, awesome game, but there was a point where I was just, ugh, do I have to record this again? And I don't g think I'll have the same feeling about this, so the overall quality of my commentary will probably be better. It's uh, easier to do commentary on a first-person shooter, I think, than on a game like X-Men Legends 2. Sorry for talking so much. I just have a lot to say and I actually have to go take out laundry of the washing machine pretty soon. So I need to do this a little fast. <laughs> but anyway, I think I I think actually I have said what I wanted to say. Okay, to sum up. Uh one, I haven't been able to get on Kira server lately. Don't know what's up with that. Two, I might be not qu exactly quitting Kira server, but not playing as much on it any as I have. Uh, nothing against her server or Kira. It's just something I feel like doing. Three, I will be making my own server. At first, it will just be a local hosted one for me and my friends. But if my economy uh, can bear it, I will make a hosted server, which will be whitelisted with people I choose to get on it. Um, three finished X Men Legends two, a awesome game with a lot of flaws. And uh, what we what else is there? Then we oh yeah, starting new game Far Cry two. And I think that's about it for this week's channel update. So sorry for talking so much. Sorry for well, I'm not sorry for talking so much. Uh, that's what this video is all about. This is about me talking about telling you what's going on and what's going to be going going to happen that's the term but sorry for speaking so fast i i sometimes do that but the cool thing about when i speak so fast is one well the, one of the bad things about me speaking so fast is that people might have a hard time understanding it i don't know but the one thing is that i actually speak more fluently i don't have the 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 uh, now i did but yeah the i i often forget words and Get where I was in the sentence. I don't do that as much when I speak fast. So, <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, uh, I think that's it. Still don't know how to end these videos. But yeah, hope you're still enjoying my channel. And uh, if you haven't already subscribed, please do. There will be a lot of cool stuff on this channel. And, uh, I'll see you sometime in the future. Bye.